Hey everyone, Ammunition here at CES 2017 in Las Vegas. It's my first CES ever and I've been having a great time checking out all the new technology, especially the VR. There's tons of VR headsets and lots of drones and the rise of autonomous technology like driving and your automated home has been really cool to see. And of course my favorite, hardware. So let's see what CES has to offer. Gaming at Intel. Tell me what you're excited about at CES. Well, at CES, like, the thing that's kind of jumping at me most is sort of how much VR is like almost showing up everywhere, right? I feel like we're at the tip of the iceberg of, you know, there's a ton of excitement, there's a lot going on. Um, I like seeing that actually the, the content that's starting to appear here. More and more games are starting to show up. We're seeing things even outside of games starting to show up in entertainment and even some commercial type things. So. From that perspective, it's really good. The other thing I love to see is the performance necessary to drive this VR experience. It's, it's amazing. The Core i7 is running that very, very immersive VR experience. We are showcasing our Intel 7th Gen series uh, products. Behind us are our gaming series notebooks, uh, all equipped with uh, Intel 7th Gen. We actually have a lot of big announcements today. And one particular is Project Valerie. It's actually the world's first triple display laptop that's automated. For the first time ever, no, one's, no one has ever built a fully integrated triple display notebook. What's unique about this system is that you know it has two computers in one. One for gaming and one for streaming. And you as a streamer probably uh, you know, are interested in something like this that's designed specifically for you. Here on the gaming side, uh, we can put anything up to uh, uh, i7. In this particular uh, example, we have the 6950K. So it's the ultimate gaming system on the top here. 